Uh, and she visited by her husband for 29 years, right? Has no communication with her husband all these years. Uh, is she obliged to perform her idda and get some news of the husband's death? Yes, of course she is because she was not divorced. Not living together does not mean that they are separated. Separation in Islam is through divorce, khul' or fasq. But if she chose to live somewhere else and he didn't mind, they didn't fulfill the rights of each other. They're still husband and wife. And if he left any money, she deserves one quarter of the inheritance if she didn't have any children from him or if he didn't have any children. And uh, if he had any children, then she would get one eighth, even if she haven't seen him for the past 10 or 19 years, as you said. Likewise, the opposite is true. A husband and wife, physically separated, but they're not divorced. So the wife died. Any money she left, he will get a share of the inheritance. Accordingly, the idda is a requirement for a woman who lost her husband four months and ten days before she start taking proposals or going for hajj or traveling, whatever. Barakallahu feekum.